All right, good morning. Oh, let's see. Yesterday we were doing our math and we were talking about earning money and what skills we need for those jobs. Well, today is our science day. It's our science day. And to finish up your author or character project, if you haven't done that, all right, but everything is due on Monday. All right, so let's see. Yesterday was 28. So today is? 29. Yesterday is over and today is just starting or just happening. 29. All right. So if yesterday was Thursday, today is Friday. Today is Friday, May 29th, 2020. Yes. Oh, look at our number. It's going to get smaller. Remember, every time we take away, that group gets smaller. So if we had five straws and we take one straw away, how many do we have left? We have four. Four straws left. Four days left for next week to finish kindergarten. Oh, and if we have 172 days and we add one more straw, 172, two plus one equals what? Three, 173. Wow, 173 days already that we have been learning since the first day of school. Uh-oh, whoops, I did it in black, I'm gonna change it. 173 days we have been learning since the first day of school. All right, so today is Friday. Today is our science day and I'll show you in just a little bit. We're gonna be reviewing our plants. We talked about last week what plants need, what they need to grow. And we talked about the parts of a plant, the parts of a plant. And the parts of the plant were very, very important because um, the plants need all of those parts, okay? We start with the seed, right? But the roots in the ground, that's what helps keep the plant in the soil. But the roots soak up the water and minerals and anything else that it needs. And then the stem helps carry the water and those minerals to the leaves or up to the flower. And when it gets in the leaves, then the flower need, the plant needs what? Sun, it needs sun. And with the sun and then the leaves, that's what makes the, the food, the chloroplast, and makes the food for the plant to grow, for the plant to grow. And then the flower starts to grow, right? And in the middle of the flower are the seeds. You know, but if there is no flower on a plant, the flower still makes seeds, but it makes maybe like, they look like little stickers or something else on the leaves that show up on the leaves or the stem that'll fall off, and those are the seeds, okay? But today we're gonna be looking at how the plant grows, the life cycle, the life cycle of a plant. Number one, okay, we know we have to start with a seed, and those seeds get planted in the ground, and it needs water, right? Water and sun. And uh, you're not gonna be able to see, but once it starts growing, the roots start to come, and then you have a little seedling, a plant starts to sprout, the sprout, okay? And then after that, it grows a little more into the seedling and you start to get, you can see the stems and the leaves better. And then you have the plant and the flower starts to bloom. And once the flower blooms, even though it doesn't have fruit, they say that this is the fruit or the part that reproduces, right? The seeds, because once the plant grows and then it starts to die, the seeds will fall off and then they'll start all over again. They'll start all over again, okay? So the seeds stay right there in the middle and that's what falls off. Like our story of the tiny seed by Eric Carle, remember? The tiny seed, the wind blew those seeds. And at the end, once that flower died, because the plants always die, maybe about winter time, and then in spring they'll plant, they'll start to grow again. We plant them, or they start to bloom and grow again in springtime. Okay, but that always happens. It's the life cycle, the life cycle. It happens over and over, just like a pattern just like a pattern, okay? But sometimes there are plants that don't have a flower, but then they grow the fruit. And in the fruit, like I showed you last time, were the seeds, remember? And those seeds are what we use to plant to get another fruit tree or another fruit or vegetable plant, plant. All right, so today you'll be watching a video and learning a little bit more about 
the life cycle of the plant. And there'll be an activity where you'll have to label the cycle for the plant and how it grows. All right. And then there's also going to be an activity to see if you can grow, to see if you can grow a plant. So there'll be an activity there, maybe like a bean plant, a lima bean. Hey, but it'll show you two ways that you can grow a plant. And that activity, you'll be able to start it today, plant your little seed, and maybe by next week, Monday or Tuesday, it'll start to grow. And you can be writing down how it's growing and what you've been doing, and then take a picture of how it is growing, how it is growing. But remember, if you put it in a cup, and once it starts to get bigger, it's gonna need more space, so you'll have to move it to a bigger pot, or maybe you can plant it in the ground and it'll keep growing. You don't know, right? Okay, but two things. So that activity about growing your own seed and plant you can do over the weekend. And this one about our life cycle. So there'll be a story or a video there. And the activity about labeling the cycle of a plant. All right, guys. Okay, so today I will be out later between one and three in the afternoon and I'll be delivering the last things that I have for you and your surprise. All right, so between one and three and also on the stream, I am putting the invite for a Zoom party with Mrs. Robinson and that Zoom party will be on Monday, Monday, June 1st. And also Monday, June 1st, I'm going to do our awards. I'm going to be handing out awards that I'll be putting in your in your packets too. But you'll get to see my little awards assembly that I will be doing, recognizing everybody on Monday. All right, so that Zoom, that Zoom link will be there for Mrs. Robinson for Monday. All right, and maybe I'll get to see you there in our Zoom party on Monday with Mrs. Robinson. Details will be in my stream, okay? And and today for our check-in, hmm, I want you to tell me, have you planted a plant before? Have you seen all the parts of the plant that we had been talking about? Have you done all of that before? Hmm. So I want you to tell me if yes, you have or no, you haven't planted a plant before, planted a seed. Okay, a plant or a seed. All right. Hope to see you guys later this afternoon. Bye. Have a good weekend.